This is Ryan with Presentation Geeks, and today we're talking about how to animate your pathway in your Prezi. Okay, so we've had a lot of people ask us how uh, they can kind of modify their pathway. So I'm going to go through this fairly quickly here. This is just a presentation that we did up a couple months ago. It talks about what makes a presentation great. And we used an acronym that says for a presentation to be great, it needs to move. It needs to be memorable, original, visual, and engaging. Somewhere along the line, when we animate this, slide three goes to the E, four to the V. Essentially, it's going backwards. So I just want to show you how we can really quickly alter that pathway, which then you can use in your own presentation if you need to change anything. So there's a few ways here. I'll just go through all of them briefly here. Number one, you always have to hit edit path. And this is going to give you a few options. You're going to get to see a visual line that shows you everywhere that that pathway is going to go. And from here, one easy way is you can simply just drag this panel in your left here. So you can move it to whatever order you want and it's automatically going to renumber and now your presentation will go in the proper order. Now that way works great if all of your slides or all of your uh, frames are already kind of bunched together. But when you get into an area where you maybe have 50 or 75 or 200 slides, it gets a little frustrating having to drag that all the way up or all the way down. So a nice thing that you can do is, let's say for example that somehow number five here got put way down at the bottom here. And so now it's 13. Yes, I could just drag it up, but imagine that I had 200 slides and that's a bit of a pain. What I can do is I can actually take that 13 and just drag it right off and that's just going to make it disappear. Now this frame is no longer part of my pathway. If I click it again, it'll automatically take the last part of your pathway, which in this case is still 13. So I'm going to drag it away again. And now all I have to do, I can just take this little plus sign that's coming right from the four. So if I drag that down and say, hey, I want you to lock onto this uh, frame right here, it automatically puts that in the five. So it's a really basic concept. All it is is just going into your edit path. Just make sure that when you're all done, you go up to the upper right, click done, and then test out your presentation to make sure it's doing everything you want. So what does make a presentation great? Besides using presentation geeks, make sure it moves. Thanks and good luck with your presentation.